Gladys, what have you done? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, I knew he would. I knew he would. And of course, Manny wasn't kidding. You can even Captain, see the weed in the pipe. Captain Calavera? Puerto Zapato, sailor. We're here at last. Beautiful port, didn't she? Yes, sir. Well, there's some customs officials down below, sir. They want to search the ship. Fine, fine. We've got nothing to hide, eh? No skeletons in our closet. Besides uh, us. Oh! Yes, sir. <laughs> Secure the bow, boys. Like a rock this time. Manuel. Salvador. I hope this very urgent message gets to you in time. Our man in Zapato says Miss Colomar never made Those it. Those hats before. are adorable. It said she threw herself overboard at the Pearl. Wait, what? I don't know if you believe that. Whatever you do, do not land in Puerto Zapato. It's a trap. Assassins will attempt to board your ship disguised as customs agents. Beware, and viva la revolucion! Oh boy, that's a problem. So, welcome back to Let's Play Grim Fandango. I'm the Raptor from Saturn, and I forgot to breathe before I start this episode! Let's go! Hey, Gladys was right. These do look better chromed. Our lovely, lovely ship. Tied nice and strong. We almost lost her at the last port, but it looks like they learned their lesson. No matter how heavy deck furniture looks, always use the proper fleece. <laughs> right. Let's go see these customs officials. I'm sure exploring a little bit around the deck didn't cause any problems, but oh fuck. Vincent. I'm sorry I led you into trouble, sailor. Ensign Arnold was just a kid. I fucking sprouted him! They sprouted all of them! Oh no. The entire crew just got sprouted. This can't be happening. He's back here! Sack him! Oh shit. Yay! Gracias, Carlos. officials, open this door. Muchísimas gracias. Oh boy. Yeah, we want to check your face. And I want to check worry, your face. Captain. We're safe in here. Okay, let's just set the explosives and get the hell out or of not. here. Or not. Oh boy. Oh boy. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? What can we do? Gladys? Gladys, what do these readouts mean? Then we're gonna blow up, Captain! And it's gonna hurt! Oh boy. That's the throttle for the port side engine. Híjole! Gladys sure did a number on that old diesel. If it were just a little more powerful, we could probably tear on out of here. I tried. Oh, I tried. But I failed. It's not powerful enough. Hey, maintain, sailor. That's the starboard anchor control. That's the port anchor control. Okay, so we can control the anchors and the port side engine from here. Looks like the anchor's down. Can't reach. So we're only a little more powerful, huh? That's the, that's the throttle for the port side engine. Got loose there.
hello, I was going the wrong way. <laughs> well, that's okay. Let's lower that anchor. We're still tied to the dock. But if we play our cards right, maybe we can... <laughs> can't, can't reach. Can't reach, huh? Ah, my trusty scythe. Never leave home without it. Let's get this baby pulled back. I think I know how we're gonna solve this little dilemma. It's not powerful enough to pull the yeah, whole ship off the go. dock, but is it powerful enough to pull the, at least, oh, say, half the ship? I'm sure how we got the engine on this side, don't we? <laughs> Gladys! Cover your ears. Gladys, cover your ears. Oh, I love it. Oh, that is so hideous, but I love it. <laughs> what was that? The dotted line, buddy. Oh, yeah. Now let's get out of here. Woohoo! I mean, I guess, I guess we did kind of thesis it enough. All right, Pearl Ho! Just a little farther, Gladys. <sighs> down and down into the deep. Guess we ran out of fuel. Got Teddy Grams. Never ran out of Teddy Grams. Where the hell are we? <laughs> Manny, choking! Mira, snap out of it, sailor. Easy for you to say, you don't have lungs. Hey, you live without your heart once, so you can live without air for a little while. Just until I figure out what we're gonna do. You alright? I'm a spirit of the land, Manny, not of the sea. Oh Hang in there, Mano. Lola, looks like I let you down again. Oh, I think her days of use are over. Hey, sorry. Oh, I cut him off, but he said, uh, I told you it was bad luck to name her that. We're underwater. We're not on the moon. What's... Beware, brave captain. Here in the darkest depths of the Sea of Lament dwell the most horrible monsters of all. Yeah, that checks out. The fearsome, murky demons of the deep will swallow you whole the instant you leave this pool of light. Heed my warning, or take one step forward and learn for yourself. All right, all right, I believe you. Just quit it with the creepy spirit of the land voice, huh? Here comes one do, 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 do. Wait a minute. Hey. Amigo. Hey, I'm talking to you. Dumbass. Okay, that might not have been a sea monster, but it was pretty spooky. It was. You all right? I'm a spirit of the le- Not hang in there, Mano. Oh, hello. I have a feeling our buddy here is going to come back around. So let's just uh, wait, shall we? Manny, are you smoking underwater? 
Are, are you... Are you smoking under... How are you even? Many, many, many! Physics is very important! Please stop breaking it. Here he comes. Mi amigo. Huh? Oh, geez, another shipwreck. You see? That's why I never travel by boat. Uh. We've had a little accident. Think you could help us out? It depends on what kind of help you're looking for. Could we borrow that light for a second? Sorry, I'm kind of attached to it. <laughs> hmm. Then... Could you take us to the Pearl? Ha! You don't believe those old stories, do you? You think somewhere in this ocean there's a gigantic pearl that shines so brightly it can be seen from passing ships? And that sometimes sailors so allured by its luster actually fling themselves overboard to dive for it and are never heard from again? Yeah, and I think it's right over... Ah, I've been walking this ocean for years. I ain't never seen it. No, really, it's over there. No, really. The pearl is right over there. You poor sucker. That's the moon. Tell me you didn't come all this way out here to pearl dive the moon. <laughs> yeah. Um. Okay. What are you doing, what are you down, doing here? down here? Trying to get out of the land of the dead, same as everybody else. Why are you walking instead of taking a I ship? I'm sick of myself. waiting around Rubicava for a boat. Figured I'd make better time this way. Why didn't I think of that? Uh, How do you know where you're going? See the moon over there? I just keep it on my right. That way I know I'm heading in a straight line. But oldest trick in the book. Oh. Okay. Could you send for help? Oh, sure. I promise to call for help at the next phone booth I walk by. Uh, how long have you been down here, anyway? How long have you been down here? Well, let me put it this way. I wasn't always this color. Oh. Oh, my. Is everything okay with your eyebrows? Them is barnacles, genius. I don't move fast enough to shake them, so they tend to pile up. I don't mind, though. They're the only company I got. <laughs> Ain't you, boys? Oh, he's insane. All right. Shouldn't you have had a Shouldn't you have hit dry land by now? I'm trying to cross a big ocean here, Sonny. What do you know about it? I've More than done. you do, apparently. A boat? a boat? Don't talk to me about boats. <laughs> What's the problem What's with the boats? What's the problem with boats? We had such a nice boat. We really Why can't. is everybody always talking about boats? You got a perfectly <sighs> good pair of legs. Why not use them, I say? Honestly, because walking at the bottom of the ocean is horrifying. Let me guess. Let me guess. You died in a boat wreck. A boat wreck would have been better than what happened to us. Led off course by bad equipment, lost for weeks, no food, no shelter from the sun. We started throwing the dead overboard. But then the sharks began following the boat. Yeah, that's not... In a situation like that, getting rid of the dead bodies is a bad idea. Just eat them. I, I know that sounds horrible, but if you have no other food and the person is already dead, I, I would argue that cannibalism is, at the very least, not a, the worst decision you could have made that day. Just don't kill anybody for food. That makes you a bad person. What happened in the end? What happened was, I learned three valuable lessons. Stay away from boats. When it comes to navigation, trust only the moon and the stars. And when there's only two of you left, never, ever go to sleep. Well, there you go. I hope you were at least delicious. Where'd you get the coral? Edge of the world, boy. That's the only place it grows. How have you kept that light going all these years? Well, I found this coral, this 
glow-in-the-dark coral. Damnedest thing. Glows like a lightning bug and never seems to wear out. I had some of that once. Made a nice grappling hook. Yeah, I don't yeah, think you had what I got, because I don't think you've been to the place where I got it. <sighs> can, we, can we tag along can with we you? tag along with you? Well, it's a long walk you're talking about. You don't have any other choice. Oh, all right then. Lift those knees, stick close to my light, and try to sing in key. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of flap, mine, flap, I'm flap, gonna let flap, it shine. Flap, this flap, little flap, light of mine, flap, I'm flap, gonna flap, let it shine. Flap, let flap, it shine, flap, let flap, it shine, flap, let flap, it shine. Flap, 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 hide it flap. under some seaweed. No! I'm gonna let it shine, hide it under some seaweed. No! I'm gonna let it shine, hide it under some seaweed. No. I'm gonna let it shine. 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 Scare away sea, sea monsters. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's what's gonna shine. Scare away sea monsters. Scare away sea monsters. Yeah. 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 Scare away sea monsters.
Bang! Zoom! Straight to the moon! Is that... Oh. I'm rich, 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 rich! Shh! Something's happening. Benny, what's going on? You know, I did a lot of activities. But, uh... This is... a distinctly disturbing activities. I don't know, but I don't like the way that thing's looking at us. I'm not going down. That octopus is tracking us. I had no idea their eyesight was so good. They actually have eyes that are better than ours. They don't even have blind spots like you do, which is pretty I cool. I think we found our transportation. That octopus is tracking us. I had no idea their eyesight was so good. And if you look, he's, he's watching. Or she. I'm not going down there while that monster's looking right at me. Let's explore around a bit, see what we can find. Not quite as famous as the Pearl is the slimy, barnacle-covered old rock of legend. When I get that desperate for food, maybe. I don't want to get tangled up in those. Let's see. Hey, wait a second. Chipito, it's following you! Hey, Chipito, go for a swim, will ya? You're drawing too much attention to us. Too bad! I'm sticking to you like the barnacles on my eyebrows, so don't even think of sneaking off with my pearl. So there really is a pearl. But does that mean Meche really jumped overboard here? It all just seems so... fishy. <laughs> Good one, Captain. Gladys. Go down there and talk demon talk to that octopus. Heck no! I'm scared! I'm staying up here with you! The difference is I'm pretty I'm sure you can't be- I'm going down there while that monster's looking right at me. So it's following Chipito. Ugh. Watch those hands, clams. Yes! Lego! Hey, Leo! Hey, where are you going? You can't leave me here all alone! Sure! Come back here! Sure I can. That's really when you first get to see how creepy Chipito looks. She's coming back. Huh. This is... You know, I know octopi were, or octopodes were smart, but this is not exactly what I was expecting. Looks like we're heading south, but there's nothing on that edge of the world except the edge. The edge of the world. Yeah, it turns out the eighth underworld is flat. Who knew? This is our stop, amigos. Manny? Don't ask, carnal, because I don't know. Yeah, this is... This is weird. See any hint of that octopus swimming around here? No, but I can smell him. I'll bet all these miners were brought here by that octopus. Well, at least it didn't eat them. That's good. I'll bet all these miners were brought here by that octopus. Look at them all so hard. Gladys, 
I'm gonna sneak inside and look for Mechi. What if that octopus comes back while you're gone? Poke him in the eye and steal his sub. <laughs> hint, hint, octopus. wink, wink, nudge, nudge. So what is this place? Ashtray so fancy you could eat caviar out of it. Children's books. Mitchie! Oh, Mitchie! Manny, what are you doing here? Three years and we I finally to found him. The trip was going, Angel. I am your travel agent, you know. By the way, thanks for that bottle of champagne you sent me. It really hit the spot. You were headed for a trap. I was trying to warn you. Domino was using me like bait. I didn't want you to end up a prisoner here like me. Prisoner? Where's your cell? Or are you just sharing a bunk with the warden? Manny, what the fuck? If that's what you think of me, then why did you come here? Because this is where he belongs. Domino. Where? Working for me. I knew you'd come around eventually. Right or wrong, Manuel Calavera is always with the winning team, right, Manny? That's why you're here now. I'm getting off this rock. And I'm taking all of these people with me. <laughs> Manny, there's no way off this island. I'm afraid you're stuck here in my little executive training program. Is that what you're See, calling I need it? You to take my place here, kid. I've got to get back to the city where the action is. Sorry, Manny, but I had to come in. My skin was getting all pruny. And your lips are getting all purple. I don't need. Gladys! Gladys! Gladys, no! Goddess! I'm gonna grind you to powder for that god on. Oh, I don't blame you for using that one. But for now, let me just show you your new office. Ow! 